Okay, so to add the text box, which is going to take the user input, again, in some of the stuff that I've done with you guys in the past, uh, or my classes has been play game based, they don't have the ability to do this very easily. So this is, is really nice. Um, so we'll have a text box area. So remember, this is just drawing all the elements. So we'll have self.user text box. Um, and we're going to use Q, Q line edit, which is a type of widget um, for making text boxes. So we're going to probably need a, a little bit more on the CSS front again. So let's do self.user text box um, dot set style sheet. Um, and we're going to probably put quite a lot in here. So I'm also going to introduce to you here the um, ability to hover. So you can have things change as you hover over them. So the way you do that in CSS is we start with a star and then we use the, these brackets here. And we're going to encapsulate one type of CSS in here and another, for, uh, which we'll do in a minute for when we're hovering. So we'll have effectively like that, and then we'll have um, another star, and this time it'll be hover like that, and like that. So anything you put in this block here is normal, and anything additional you put in here, will, or, or anything that's different will change when you're hovering over it. So it's quite nice to do this uh, for buttons and things like that. So anyway, um, I've got color, is black and um, we'll leave that in speech marks and um, font size we'll have as 30 and um, border because we want it to look like a text box so it looks like users can enter data without us giving them information so we'll have a solid border around it and we'll have it black You'll realize the, f the more videos I do, even when they get technical, I uh, I am no good at styling. So you, I'm sure you can make your programs look a lot better than mine. It's not really my thing. Uh, so we'll have a radius on it just because I do think curved boxes look a lot more modern, nicer. Um, we'll put a margin on it. Um, so if you do margin, this is another way of doing centered. So if you do margin left, and um, I remember doing this a long while ago in HTML stuff I was doing, um, and you do margin right, and you set it to auto, it will automatically um, put things in the middle. So it's another way of doing it. Uh, background, um, color. And we'll have a background color of white because we've got black font. So we'll have um, hashtag FFFFFF, which is white. I could have just wrote white, that's fine. And then in the hover, all we'll do is we'll change the um, background and the text. So we'll change the uh, background to. Um, Zero E sub one ninety. I need to remember these, uh, and we'll change color to white. So nothing will happen at me because I've not even added it. So I'm going to also do um, self dot user what did I call it user lowercase from that user text box um set max length and I'm gonna have it as three 
So this is because I'm going to probably do a random number between 0 and 999 or something like that. So I don't want to use entering numbers that are too long. Um, I could just do this again as I do this on most things. Although I might not need it because I've done the margins left and right. So you shouldn't really do both. But it's another way of centering. Um, and I need to add to grid, grid dot add widget, and I'm going to add it add the user text box, and I'm going to add it into row four. So I'm sure the last one was three. Yeah. So the row below, and I'm going to say it's uh, column zero, spanning one row but three columns. And you see, look. As I hover over it, you can see the style changing. So if I type, it's quite nice, isn't it? So it's a nice effect. So I've got my guest box now, and that's how to do a user text box. So the next thing I'm going to do is do a button, make it look like a button. So it's obviously it can be clicked again, and um, similar way that we've just done that. Um, and then after that, it's just a game and, and linking all these things together which is, is far more straightforward than you probably imagine. Yeah.